www.thestrategy.com. Hi, this is Chris again. Taking a look at the upcoming session for Thursday, October 22nd, fxempire.com. The uh, economic calendar in front of you, I'm looking at three things specifically. Uh, the first thing is the German manufacturing PMI coming out uh, for October. A preliminary number anticipated to be 49.5. If it's better than that, um, expect the DAX and the Euro both to get a little bit of a boost. Uh, of course, it works the other way around, too. If it's worse than anticipated, it should drive them lower. Retail sales coming out of the UK could affect the FTSE and the pound dollar. Uh, anticipated to lose a tenth of a percent, so that, of course, can move the markets as well. Um, be watching the um, uh, pound uh, dollar and the um, FTSE for reaction to that. Stronger than anticipated, of course, moves them higher. Worse than anticipated, of course, moves them lower. Looking at the initial jobless claims, you can see that um, that is the next thing I'm paying attention to. And um, that being the case, uh, 282,000 is the anticipated uh, move. If we get a less than uh, expected um, number, then of course uh, that should be strong because it shows that less people are looking for work in the United States. That could really move the S&P 500 uh, going forward. Looking at the S&P 500 first, you can see that we are having a fairly benign session on Wednesday, but really after this move, that's not a big surprise. A little bit of a pullback to find support, and we would be all over that buying calls. The initial jobless claims number will probably move this market. Remember, the lower that number, the better it is. Uh, so it is a little bit opposite of what we're used to, but uh, we think 19 at this point in time will be very supportive. Looking over at the Euro dollar, um, you can see that we have, in fact, broken down a little bit. Um, one uh, 27 gave way, and it appears that we are going to drop lower. Uh, the market seems like it just cannot keep up, and those German numbers, of course, could push us over the cliff. We are buying puts, and we believe that this market goes down to the 125 level. Looking at the DAX, we had a uh, fairly benign session there as well. It appears that 8,900 is offering support. We formed a nice looking hammer. A move above 9,000 puts us in the previous consolidation area. So we are buyers of calls on pullbacks to show signs of support and a break above 9,000 specifically, but even a break above the top of the hammer. It's probably reason enough to start going long. Uh, those German numbers could move this market. And finally, the uh, silver market, uh, as you can see, um, is certainly looking very bearish again uh, probably got some support at, at 17 though so really uh, would prefer to sell rallies in other words buy puts on short-term charts uh, with short-term expirations and with that i've taken a look at the upcoming thursday october 23rd trading session